It is no secret just how fast COVID-19 can spread. And for a small town, a spread can have a big impact. KCAU 9 News reporter Lydia Vasquez tonight telling us how the community of Denison, Iowa, is working to keep the virus at bay. That's it, our top story tonight at 6. Denison, Iowa is a town of around 8,000 people. The town's police department has 13 full-time officers. I'm concerned that um, we could potentially see a widespread spike in number of cases within the county. Police Chief Dan Schaefer says if that were to happen, it would be devastating to the town and his department. But he says he's comfortable with the measures they have in place. We wear a mask anytime we have to uh, come in contact with the public. Um, we try to, uh, if we're able to take complaints and do it over the phone, we do that. Otherwise, if we have to go out and meet with public um, face to face, then we try to keep a six feet distance and then wear a mask at the same time. Sergeant Doug Melby says with just over a dozen officers, it's critical that they follow those precautions. Chief Schaefer says three weeks ago he was concerned. They didn't have much of a plan, and he says their resources were limited. That's why he's calling on all other resources for assistance. The Croft County Sheriff and I have had discussions about this. Uh, our departments work very closely together on a daily basis. Um, we, you know, we would share services. Uh, between the two agencies. Chief Schaefer says he will also reach out to state police and neighboring communities if he feels a COVID-19 outbreak makes it too difficult to provide proper service. In Denison, Iowa, Lydia Vasquez, KCAU 9 News.